No sign of Darth Angrel, but Euphrates. I saw this planet once, with Master Kawix. It used to be green. General, I've arrived at Euphrates. There's no sign of Angrel, but the planet... See for yourself. Receiving your sensor readings. Stand by. Euphrates' atmosphere looks like it's on fire. What could have done that? Damage consistent with designs recovered on Ord Mantel. The Desolator weapon. If Darth Angrel has a weapon that can do this, the Republic is doomed. There's virtually no vegetation left. Even the oceans are boiling. Euphrates had millions of citizens. Whole continents of farmlands. All that life extinguished. The scale of this is... it's unthinkable. Getting an emergency transmission. It's faint, coming from the far side of the planet. Republic vessel, do you copy? This is medical frigate Daybreaker. We're under attack. Imperial commandos have boarded us. Help! It's one of ours. The crew may know what happened here. No more of our people died today. Kira, plot an intercept course. Already done, Master. Strap yourselves in. That was the last of the Imperials. You're safe now. Not a minute too soon. Those commandos weren't taking prisoners. I still can't believe what happened to Euphrates. When we arrived, an Imperial ship was attacking the planet. I've never seen anything like it. Euphrates was trapped inside an energy field. Some starships tried to flee, but their engines failed before they could leave the atmosphere. No one escaped. Every ship that tried crashed back onto the surface. The enemy made sure there wouldn't be survivors. We tried to run, but Imperial boarding pods overtook us. I saw Euphrates' atmosphere catch fire. Horrific destruction. Flames consumed the planet. Everything turned to smoke and ash in seconds. Could anyone have escaped the destruction? I don't see how. Captain, look at this. Our sensors detect faint life readings on the planet's surface. Possible survivors. Anyone left on that planet is as good as dead. If we go down there, we can provide food, water, shelter, and medicine. It's our duty. The energy field surrounding Euphrates will destroy your ship's engines. You won't be able to leave. We can't abandon the survivors. We're the only hope those people have. Every second counts. Please, he'll listen to you. Talk to him. It's not that I don't want to help, but I have a family to think about. This ship carries combat-grade Colto packs, battle adrenals, you name it. Talk her out of this crazy idea. You'll have your pick of our supplies. I've pinpointed the strongest life signs. We can land immediately. Render aid to anyone you find. I promise you won't be abandoned down there. This is insane. I'm taking an escape pod off this lunatic asylum. My crew can do this without him. Thank you for doing what's right. I'm transmitting our sensor logs of the attack to your ship. Please give them to the Republic High Command. You better go. People on Euphrates need us. I rescued the Daybreaker, General. I have sensor logs of Engril's attack. However, the crew landed on Euphrates to help possible survivors. They're trapped. We'll get them back somehow. But Engril is our first priority. Transmitting sensor logs now. My initial analysis indicates the Desolator has a similar flaw to the planet prison. The weapon's excessive power requirements demand a lengthy charging period before it can fire. Small consolation. Angle's next attack will undoubtedly be more direct. The entire Republic should be warned about this. 
Varsin needs to begin food rationing immediately. I'll contact the Galactic Senate and put every Republic world on... Wait. We're getting another emergency alert from Typhon. Relaying it now. Under attack by Darth Angrel. Launching defense fighters. Angrel's battlecruiser deploying energy weapon. Our ship can't escape Typhon's atmosphere. We're trapped. That explains why Angrel left Euphrates so quickly. He's already chosen his next target. Send everything you've got to Tython. Now, General. The Republic fleet's in hyperspace. By the time it's redirected to Tython, it'll be too late. The Desolator needs time to work. The Jedi may be trapped on Tython, but you're not. You could board Angrel's battlecruiser. Disable the weapon before it fires. I'll disable that weapon, and Darth Angrel will answer for his crimes. I'll use the sensor logs to find the Desolator's weak point. Contact us when you're aboard Angrel's warship. The Force be with you. General, we got a little scorched, but we're inside Angrel's battlecruiser. Yes, I knew you could do it. Now to end that Sith for good. It won't be that simple. The sensor logs of Angrel's warship reveal he's amplified the vessel's reactors. That's a little trick he learned from me when I was interrogated by his spy on Taris. Blast his truth serums and mind probes. Disarming the Desolator weapon will necessitate overloading at least three shielded reactor relays. No simple task. General? Doctor? My team's moving out. We'll save Tython or die trying. Don't even think that. I expect us all to reach a ripe old age. Your signal's breaking up. May the... Ingrid's jamming our transmissions. He's coming for us. Thanks for the vote of confidence, T7. Be careful out there. You will not steal my victory. Not now. I have sacrificed too much for this. I will avenge my son on you and all the Jedi. Sacrifice? Is that what you call your genocide on Euphrates? This was merely a test, and a lure to bring you here. I foresaw this confrontation. I welcome it. Today I forge a new era for the Sith. One where the Jedi are finally extinct. Finish this, Angrel. I command it. With pleasure, my master. What... what was that? I felt... the Emperor... You are his child. His eyes, his ears. His weapon to command. Come, child. Fight by my side. It's where you belong. I'd rather jump out an airlock naked. I can handle Angrel. Get yourself to safety. There's no place safe from him. I won't leave you. If you will not serve, you will die. For Tarnis. dead, and this battlecruiser's not far behind him. Disappointing. Angrel was useful. This child must learn her place. And so will you. Whatever you are, you won't win. I see futures in you. Futures I will not allow. 
Your future ends here. This child is unfinished, weak. I will make her strong. Now you will die. Even if my child must die with you. No, I won't kill for you. You're stronger than the dark side. Push it back. I'll help you. You already did. The dark side has no power over me. I am a Jedi. He's gone. I won. I'm finally free. What was it like under the Emperor's control? Were you aware of our duel? All of it. I was in my head the whole time, like a prisoner. The ship's coming down on top of us. Let's get out of here. The Force, you're alive. When I saw Angro's battlecruiser explode, I feared the worst. Good to see you, Master Satil. Everyone safe down there? We are now, thanks to you. Please come to the surface. Bring your Padawan to the Council Chambers. We all have much to discuss. Welcome home. The Jedi owe you a debt of gratitude we can never repay. The Jedi wore Republic medals. Your robe would be covered in them. Only wish Master Orgus could share in this victory. I'll honor his legacy to the end of my days. We all will. He was a great teacher. And a good friend. We've lost one of our noblest masters. But in his place stands a Jedi without equal. And you, Padawan. I knew you'd remain true to us. I see no reason why we shouldn't make Kira a full-fledged Jedi Knight. I agree. My troubled former Padawan has matured into a fine Jedi. As leader of this council, it's my pleasure to promote Kira Carson to the rank of Jedi Knight. You mean it? Just smile and say thank you. Thank you. This is more than I ever hoped for. The danger to Tython is over. But we're getting fresh reports of hostilities all over the galaxy. Another war with the Empire seems inevitable. Darth Angrel was the spark that lit the flame. Even in failure, he inspired the Sith to violence. But he also forged our greatest weapon against the darkness. The Force has shown me what lies ahead. The futures of many rest on your actions. You will decide the fate of the Jedi, the Republic, the galaxy. Master, that's quite a burden. I'm only one Jedi. The will of the Force can't be denied. But I'll stand by you through everything we must face. May the Force be with you. With all of us. The Force is with you, now and always. Master Orgus? His power is growing. Only you can stop him. You must go to Tatooine. Stop who? Why Tatooine? A starship crashed in a desert canyon. Use the Force. Find it. Who were you talking to? The holocom's not even on. Must have been your imagination. I wasn't talking to anyone. Got you practicing a speech, huh? Planning to run for Supreme Chancellor? Ready to go when you are. I assume you have a destination in mind? All I know is I'm done with this place. Finally, something we agree on. <laughs>